And so, as you guys know, I love tape. That might be a little bit of an understatement. I have so much duct tape, washi tape, packing tape, painter's tape, every kind of tape you can imagine. But recently, I added a new type of tape to my collection, and that is nail tape. This is a really thin tape that can be sparkly or shiny or just matte. It comes in a variety of colors and is usually used in nail art to either mask off part of the design or to be a part of the design itself. But when I searched on Pinterest for other uses for nail tape instead of just nail art, nothing really came up. So today I have four easy DIYs for you using nail tape even if you don't have the coordination to paint anything fancy on your nails. So before I start, a quick tip to just keep all of your nail tape organized is to grab some empty tape dispensers. You can put multiple rolls of nail tape on each one and then they won't get scattered everywhere and also they look really pretty. So for the first project, I think we can dress up this plain triangle vase that I got at the dollar store. The nail tape actually stuck really well to glass, so I just cut off pieces and stuck them on in varying angles. I cut down the excess on the top and the bottom, and soon I had this really nice subtle design on my vase. It's perfect for displaying small flowers, or craft supplies, or whatever you have lying around. For my next project, I grabbed my phone charger, and you might remember I actually did a DIY about decorating phone chargers a few months ago. This is along the same lines, but I'm just going to apply each color of nail tape individually to get this really pretty rainbow effect. Just make sure the seam where you're starting and ending each row is on the same side of the charger. And then just one color at a time, build up your rainbow. Once you're happy with how it looks, just cut down a small piece of packing tape and apply that over the seams of all of the tape so that they don't start peeling up. And now you have a cute rainbow phone charger that is so shiny, so sparkly, and I swear, in person with all the different colors and textures, it's just beautiful. This next one is really, really easy. So if you want to dress up a simple bangle bracelet, just grab one color of nail tape and wrap it around the bracelet. You can also do this with multiple colors of tapes. You could make stripes, you could add just kind of some random designs, whatever you want. And so you've added some visual interest to a boring, plain old bracelet. And plus, if you ever want to change it up, it's removable. And finally, I'm going to make a fun pattern using both washi tape and nail tape. I'm going to put it on a phone case, but you could also do it on the cover of a notebook or in a scrapbook or wherever you just want a fun pattern. So just cut out the shape of your phone case from cardstock and cover it in washi tape. I decided to go for a black and white polka dot design. Trim that down and then just start adding diagonal stripes with the nail tape. Add as many as you like and fold the excess over to the back of the paper. And now you have a really fun pattern that you can pop into your phone case if you want to turn your phone into a fashion accessory. I love the subtle pop of color and the little bit of shininess if you catch the sun just right. I think it came out so cute. So I hope you guys liked those DIY ideas, let me know in the comments if you ever use nail tape, if you use it on your nails or for any other DIY projects. And remember that August is going to be our back to school month, so if you have any requests for DIYs that you want to see under the umbrella of back to school, please leave those in the comments and your idea might be featured in one of our videos. So that's going to be it from me for today. I basically have scraps of nail tape everywhere that I have to go clean up. But make sure to press like and subscribe and I will see you all again next week. Bye everyone!